Hey everybody, if you don't already know, I'm O and welcome to my channel. In today's video, we're picking back up where we left off in the last video, getting back outside, doing more yard work, trying to get it together. In the last video, I did hose down all of the um, furniture that we have back here because they're a bit weathered. I just wanted to give them a fresh coat of paint. Last year, I purchased this potting bench and um, decided to use it as a drink station. It also needed a little TLC. If you have not seen that video, it will be linked in the description. Check it out. I want to thank you all for clicking on this video. If you are new here, welcome. I'm O. My channel is a lifestyle channel with a heavy emphasis on creativity. I love to do DIY, home decor, home improvement, things like that. I, I just like trying things out. I love thinking outside of the box and just seeing if I can. How else am I going to know if I can do a thing if I don't try? If that sounds like your jam, hit that like button. Leave me a comment, subscribe, and don't forget to ring my bell. All my yard work came to a stop. Not only has it been cold, but it has been raining. It rained for like three days straight. All outdoor curtains are not created equally. These did extremely well considering that I left them up all throughout uh, fall and winter. They did really well. I will actually link them in the description. In my last video, I talked about wanting to create my own patio. I am still um, considering that, thinking about it, going through all the variables, but I did decide that I wanted to pour a small concrete slab where it is that we currently keep our drink station. So I went off to Home Depot to kind of do my research. And also online, I found this um, couple, oh, I don't want to get their name wrong. It's cajun country something i'm so sorry if i'm getting it wrong but they um have this method that they've come up with um of dry pouring a concrete slab which is completely um opposite of the traditional way tons of people are hating because they're mad that they didn't come up with the idea i love them for this i love thinking outside of the box so i am thrilled to try my hand at doing this as well Their method requires creating a frame um, that you would pour the concrete into. Of course, it would be the size and the shape um, of your liking. Um, 
I chose the wood that I chose. I don't think that was a great idea, but I chose it because I'm thinking I don't need like special wood that's going to be used outside because it's only temporary. However, this wood, although I would love to use it um, for a project inside, it kind of had like maybe one of them had a bow in it. And I'm like, that's not great for keeping it flush to the ground. So don't be mean. But me, I'm going to make it work. For this project, my drink station had to double as a workstation. So I got the frame together. I wanted to clear out the area, flatten it as much as I can. I really wanted to stick with the type of concrete that I saw them use in their video, but I can't find it. So um, this will be the end of this project in this video, but stay tuned in the next video. So once that was done, it was time to move on and pot some plants. You guys, it is raining again. It's raining again. So I've got to hurry up and try to get the last bit of what I can get done before it comes down heavier. So back outside. This area is where we have our hostess planted. Um, but when they dug for our um, fence, they left this huge mound of this heavy, thick clay dirt on top of this area. So we had to break through this clay. We were pleasantly surprised, and I'm sure it was thanks to all this rain, they eventually started sprouting. The back area where we had the uh, garage removed was the perfect place to um, use this excess dirt. We decided to add more plants to this area since it's more closed off now we can have a designated area and there's room for more all right you guys that is it and that is all for this video hopefully going forward the weather won't hold me hostage will the concrete slab be a success i don't know but find out next time on i put the owen mom and thanks for watching